What's up guys, Fire Kanji here, back with another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be going over the best drop spot, the best loadout, and the best rotation um, strategy in Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 4 Zero Build. As always, if you guys like this video, hit the like button, subscribe, notification bell, and let's get into it. So the first thing you wanna do is land in Mega City. The reason you wanna land in Mega City is because everybody's gonna be landing as a new POIs right now. So it's gonna be relatively uncontested. I never, I, I did this strat like many times and it's getting me a lot of wins. And I never came across more than two people at this POI. So, um, and there's a vault here. That's the reason you, you're gonna land here. The vault is um, not random. It spawns here every single game, guys. So you get the um, key card, you're gonna go in this door. Um, there's a camera here, uh, it marks you, so you gotta uh, make sure you shoot the camera first. Okay. And sometimes there's a turret in this, this room, like right now there's a turret, but sometimes it doesn't spawn. So if, the, if it spawns here, just use this vent door as a shield. So if you do the head, I got hit a little bit, if you do the head glitch right like this, you won't get hit. You can't get hit. So very simple guys, um, anybody can do it. Get the vault. Um, that's one of the best perks in the game right there on the goal. You can basically get um, infin infinite shockwaves and consumables from that perk. Um, anyway, our loadout is almost complete. So what you want to have guys is a twin mag assault rifle, the infiltrated um, sh shotgun, and the uh, suppressed pistol, and shockwaves and heals. That is literally the best loadout. This is the best loadout guys in Fortnite Zero Build Chapter 4 Season 4. So yeah, next thing you're going to ro rotate out of Mega City, you're going to want to have a key. Find a key by either eliminating opponents, looting, or um, the key augment. And then you rotate right out of Megas to this hollow chest. Then by now the, um, a tower boss should have spawned. So you want to get to the tower boss. Um, um, the recovery cache is good too. But the reason the tower is better is because um, you have a chance to get legendary weapons. You get legendary weapons, you get slurp juice, and you get the forecast uh, which shows you the every zone for the remainder of the entire game um fortnite did buff the ai the bosses so they're they have they laser you a bit more now so you just gotta um, play smart use cover and then take them out if it's on the edge of zone like this it's actually better because less chance of other players trying to come for it So yeah, once you do that, you want to get the slurp, and there's another card, a vault card you have to get. So you get the card, you swipe it here. Okay, so now it says forecast security, you can see the future storm circles. And that's for the entire game, guys. Okay, there's a guy here, I'm going to try to get to higher ground first. Oh, too late. Sniper. Oh god, that was not a good pump. Nice. GG. Good timing. Um yeah guys. If you want to learn some advanced combat techniques and increase your chances of winning 50-50s like that dramatically. Um or significantly then watch my advanced zero build combat techniques video okay there's a guy rotating out of shattered again like I said keys and hollow chest is very good I just got the gold pump and if you look at the minimap thanks to that forecast boss 
Um, yeah, so getting the tower, guys, not only shows you how and where to rotate, like it's basically teaching you how to rotate. And it's a big advantage, guys, really big advantage. It's basically the forecast augment, but you get it from the tower now. So another big thing is patience. A lot of people just run into fights and just run into their death. Um, I see it too much. You can get involved like here, but be smart, you know. Um, shoot down a tree if you can. The trees do a lot of damage. They can even uh, eliminate people. And even here, I'm not crouching on purpose because they can see my footsteps and then um, it'll make it more chaotic for them. But you're gonna wanna wait to the perfect timing. Like, okay, right now somebody left somebody just left and somebody just died so that, that's the perfect timing this is how you want a third party um, in a smart way unfortunately I'm getting shot from every angle okay use the trees as always trees are your friend guys trees are your friends but yeah um, if you want to play really smart and just for the win you might want not want to take those fights but yeah I do it um, so you guys get some nice clips for you guys a little bit more entertainment um, and practice practice my combat skills show off the combat skills a bit um, like I said guys okay never mind that um, yeah, one thing I want to talk about, if you're having a hard time with the uh, Twin Mag rifle, it's probably because you're who's spraying holding the trigger. So it's basically like the old red eye. It's basically a green eye. Um, same thing, low fire rate, um, tap fire rifle. So you're going to want to tap fire at long range. Really long range is no good, especially for um, controller players. But mid range is really good, high damage. Okay, see, you see all those movements, guys. There's a reason you always want to stay moving, even if it's little movements, because you never know if somebody's aiming at you with a sniper, they can take you out at one shot. So here, I think I shot him in the storm, but he might just be behind that tractor. See, so I'm aware of. Notice how I'm aware of where uh, both the players are. This guy is really intent on sniping right now. So uh, yeah, notice how I got the shockwave ready. I'm always moving, even if, even if it's just a bit, a little bit. You wanna keep your fingers ready to, your twitch muscles ready to react. Always look around, make sure nobody's sneaking up. It takes a split second to get snuck up on, or to lose your um, location of your opponent. Um, yep. So you stay by the I stay by the wall because so if you're next to a building and somebody's on the roof or on the top of a mountain, you want to stay next to the wall because that's it's almost acts like your cover. Like okay, so that guy has the best spot in the zone right now. You got the higher ground. He also has that turret gun set up, which is the most annoying item in Fortnite. Pretty OP very annoying so the gun is shooting the turret gun is shooting so I kind of know where the other guy is so I'm gonna take advantage of this and spray that um, spray this guy he's really weak he's like 50 HP now there there we go big example guys you see if I was standing still those little movements saved my life if I was standing still I, I wouldn't be here right now I pretty much would have been sent back to the lobby guaranteed Okay, so we pushed that guy, got rid of him, but you notice, I call that a calculated push, guys. You're pushing the pe person, but in a smart way. Smartest way possible. Okay, so. Yeah, try to stay out of line of sight. Like I said, um, don't run in a straight line. Okay, so here, when you're behind cover, and the, the opponent is being pushed out by the storm and he has to run towards you or anytime somebody pushes towards you you're gonna wanna get as much damage as you can 
before they um, come near you and then finish with the shotgun so um, yeah this new this new pump rifle I'm um, not pipe rifle this new pump shotgun is not as strong as the uh, sharp tooth and the havoc was so you can't use it for opening damage and then just switch to your spray and finish them something like that you're gonna have to do um, opening damage with your spray or your uh, or your rifle first then finish with that that's how you use that shotgun so yep um, yeah guys I'm always giving you guys the gems um, uploading more I'm gonna be uploading seriously I'm taking the schedule seriously um, if you guys you know learned at least one thing found this video helpful um, smash the like button hit the notification bell it takes two seconds for you guys but it helps me out it helps me grow my channel get better at making content for you guys um, so yeah and I'm gonna see you guys in the next one that's it for this one peace